<sighs> Took you long enough. I was dying of boredom. <laughs> I didn't expect to run into you here. That voice! The worst possible combination. That was actually pretty good, I guess. Your skills are impressive, in or out of a Panzer Soldat. Musei's orbital rifle skills were better than I expected, too. <laughs> you flatter me. <laughs> Don't need you to tell me how great I am. Let's follow the instructor. Yeah, he's way ahead of us. You guys can come with us, but you have to be careful. Understood. Let's go already! No turning back now! Come on! Let's continue onward. The 36th floor. We can get to the roof from the 40th floor. Let's keep going. 39th floor. Last one. Almost at the rooftop. Long time no see, Kruger. You too, Ashen Kid. Weird place for a reunion, though, huh? Hmm. <laughs> I would have much preferred a tea party. I knew it was you. That power within you. Now I understand how much of a monster you really are. Oh yeah? You say that, but you looked in the mirror lately? That ogre power of yours is much more a part of you now than it was the last time we met. <sighs> Perhaps you should refrain from calling the Divine Knight. It may do little more than agitate him. Yes, I know. We fought him for a little bit back at the Infernal Castle. I have an idea what he's capable of. Hey now, you make it sound like all I ever want to do is fight. I'm nowhere near as bad as Valter or Little Miss Ogre, you know? <laughs> I don't know about that. <laughs> ...you 
It's a pleasure to finally meet you face to face, Mr. Ashen Guy. Allow me to introduce myself. Enforcer number zero, Campanella the Fool. You're the one from the swamp. First you summoned cryptids, now this. Are you after the inspection team? <laughs> I just came to say hello and run a little experiment. If you would like for us to do something more villainous, we can always burn this tower to ashes. Or rather, he can. There you go, pushing all the work onto me. <coughs> they said something about an experiment back in Hamel, too. <sighs> my, my, Kruger! No need to make such a scary face. We haven't seen each other in four years, and this is how you greet us? Oh, I suppose you go by Sharon now, don't you? You may address me however you wish. Last we met was when you requested my aid in stopping Lady Sarah. Huh? Ah, yes, the Gospel Plan in Liberal. We needed to attack the Bracer Guild in the Empire to lure away the Divine Blade, Cassius Bright. But first, we needed to make sure the Purple Lightning, the youngest A-rank Bracer at the time, didn't interfere. So we made sure she had a tough time coming back home from North Ambria. As a result, the Divine Blade had to postpone his return to Liberal. And so, the first stage of the Professor's brilliant gospel plan was complete. Oh yeah, Luve told me about that. <laughs> All that really happened? Yes. That is the full extent of my misdeeds. So long as the Reinford family is not at risk, I will not try to stop the wrongdoings of my prior colleagues. However, Chairman Arena and the others are presently in this tower. If you intend to attack this building, I will stand in your way, as the severing chains. Sharon! <laughs> You've changed quite a bit from the old days, haven't you? You're completely different from when you joined the Society as one of the Order's leftovers. <laughs> Was that really 12 years ago? Damn. <laughs> Back then, I was a pitiable little girl who didn't even know how to smile. Allow me to pay you back for the time you defeated me in battle. I don't know what you're after, but I have people I need to protect. Fool. Almighty Conflagration. You've met your match. <laughs> Be nice if that were true. Hmm. I don't think I even need to do anything this time. There! We made it! Stay back! These two are genuine monsters! The Enforcers! Wait, is one of them just a kid? I don't know who he is, but the other one is a tremendous threat. <laughs> well, either way, they both look pretty intense. Yes. Things seem to have escalated. <laughs> Ash and Muse, too. Huh? Oh, hey. You're the Black Rabbit, aren't you? <laughs> then perhaps I'll entertain them. What? He teleported? <clears throat> no! Hey, kid. Shouldn't you be paying attention to your own battle? Leave them be for now. His strength is comparable to my own. But against this one, if we aren't focused, we will die. <laughs> Class 7, Muse, Ash, begin two-pronged defensive! Here are your orders. Survive, no matter what it takes! <laughs> yes, sir! Understood. Acknowledged. As you wish. Don't need you to tell me that. <laughs> this is starting to get exciting! Alright, show me a good time. <laughs> show me what you can do!
very well. Ah! Strike! <laughs> Eight down! It's mine! <laughs> <laughs> Not today! Yes! Azure wings, shoot! <laughs> My turn! You're mine! <laughs> gotcha! <laughs> It's my turn! Break through! Sledgehammer! It's my turn! Ah, take this! Whoa! Let's go! Ah. Ha! My turn! Ah. Strike! Howie! Eight down! It's mine! Howie! Yes! Let's go! It's mine! Howie! All right! Break through! Sledgehammer! All right! Uh, take this! I got this. You're mine! <laughs> My turn! Uh, strike! Uh, there! Yuna! Okay! Yes! yes. Whoa! Yeah. It's my turn! Uh, take this! Yeah. I'm going! Break through! Sledgehammer! Yes! Heal our wounds! Sephiral rain! Thank you. <laughs> Thanks! Thanks! Let's go! Ah! Uh, strike! Uh, there! It's mine! Uh, my turn! You're mine! Whoa! This is it! Uh, one more! I'll finish it! Sure. You're mine! <laughs> you guys are actually pretty fun. Maybe I'll get a little serious now. <laughs> Here! Foolish. So, what'll you show me? <laughs> it's my turn. Lead. 
leave this to me. How does this suit you? Now! An Away. opening! It's my turn! Get back! You little... Leave this to me. Witness the severing chains! Ha! I'm afraid your fate is now sealed! Fall into death's embrace! Ah! Huh. That it? I'm up! Ha! Here, let me let show me you something far. This one's a scorcher. Incandescent Hover! Sorry, a mistake. everyone. <laughs> He's strong. If only I could find an opening. <laughs> oh, what fun! I'm glad to see how much you've grown. You almost made me get a little serious. But if you keep holding back like that, it won't be any fun. Go wild, kid! Let's howl together like wolves at the moon! I can't let him unleash his full power. But at this rate... Not so fast! Machius! Elisa! My lady! Let's light up the moon! The fire vanished? It was simply an illusion the whole time. Whoa, you're a sharp one. Ah, uh, you're Emma's... Did that cat just freaking talk? If it isn't Abyss's family... Man, it was lit up so beautifully, too! Reen, are you okay? You guys... Sharon, are you alright? <laughs> My apologies. I seem to have stumbled a little. If you intend to continue fighting, I'll be your opponent. I am Vita Clotilda's sister disciple under Crimson Roselia. And a member of the old class seven, Emma Milstein. Oh, ho. so you've got the same power Abyss has then. It seems this Hexen clan is quite the family. <laughs> this is way more exciting than the snooze fest at the Vermilion Castle. I'm all warmed up now. Let's get started on round two. That's quite enough, vile serpents. Huh? Your Highness, Toa, and everyone else. Randy! T took you long enough. Good. We made it in time. Is everyone okay? Sorry. It took us a while to clean up all those machines swarming the place. It's been a while, fool. Well, if it isn't the War God's son. 
Your sister and I have become fast friends. Ah, so he's that ogre chick's big brother, huh? I'm not her brother. We're cousins, okay? Machias, Elisa, Emma, good work. I'm well acquainted with you already, fool. And you were the blazing demon, I believe? <laughs> what do they call you again? The debaucherous prince? Far as I can sense, you got some pretty interesting power in you, considering you're just some royal. <laughs> I'm guessing it's the Arnor blood. And over here, it seems we have the infamous Jade Rook. <laughs> <laughs> I haven't been called that in a while. As Governor General, this tower is under my jurisdiction. Surely your masters have taught you common courtesy, servants of Ouroboros. <laughs> this really is getting rather fun! But I'm sorry to say our time is up. <laughs> Would have liked to fight you, but looks like we didn't get the ones we wanted. Besides, today was just the pre-show. <laughs> you have our thanks for keeping us company this fine evening. Why the hurry? Surely you could show your thanks with a gift before you depart. I think perhaps some information would do quite nicely. Huh? <laughs> and what is it that you'd like to know? Must I say it? Who was it you came here for? And why is the Witch of the Abyss not with you? Ugh. That's true. If Vita was here in Crossbell, then... It is most strange that she would not have accompanied you. I can feel her presence somewhere in this land. But if she hasn't shown herself here, it can only mean... Maybe she's not with Ouroboros anymore? Ding, ding, ding! That's absolutely correct! There were a few differences in opinion among the Anguis. And she got shot down six to one! After that, she stormed off on her own. Not even we know where she went. We're supposed to capture her. But it's kind of a pain. Just like I thought. What is that woman up to? Emma? But that's not all, is it? You said you didn't get the ones you wanted. Therefore, there must be someone else. Zephyr was active in Sutherland at some other party's behest. But thanks to the Intelligence Division and the RMP, the Jaegers have been driven out of the entire Crossbell region. So, who is it? And what possible experiment could you be running by causing all this commotion? <laughs> I see. <laughs> well done, debaucherous prince. <laughs> you might have got knocked down a peg or two, but you're still sharp as ever, huh? What is that silhouette? Is that... Altina, Emma, Celine! Got it. Understood. Yes. This is... the thing that wiped out an entire Calvardian Airborne Division. Not quite. Presenting the Ion-Type Beta 2, the newest model, fresh off the assembly line. Well, we don't have the Septarian's power, so we can't show off its full potential. But if you wait a bit longer, we'll be able to show you a trick or two. <laughs> no, we wouldn't dream of getting in the way of your inspection or your field exercises. So ta-ta for now. Shut the hell up! Huh? Yuna? I've sat here and listened to your nonsense long enough. 
This is our country. And you think you can come in here and do whatever you want? And now, to top it all off, you bring that thing back with you! I can't. I'll never forgive you! Yuna... Yuni, wait. <sighs> <laughs> well, well. Aren't you a spirited one? I take it you're a local. But really, what are you going to do about it? Just going to take all that righteous rage and charge in alone? If that's what it takes, then yes! But I'm not the only one who calls Crossbell home! The special support section will fight too! Lloyd, Arios, Yin, Noel, Mr. Dudley, Chief Sergei, even Zeit, Ellie, and Tio too! And Randy's already here! There's no way the SSS will let the likes of you run free! Has this been on her mind this whole time? Yuna? <sighs> <laughs> the special support section, hmm? Well, they certainly would be quite the opponents, but... I believe they're a bit tied up at the moment, courtesy of His Excellency, the Governor General. Huh? <laughs> Wait, Mishlam is blockaded, so does that mean... The blockade wasn't to stop them from entering Mishalem. It's to keep them from leaving. So they're keeping everyone affiliated with the SSS penned up in Mishalem. <gasps> <laughs> Don't misunderstand. It isn't as though we have them chained up or anything of the sort. We've simply turned Mishalem into a birdcage to keep Bannings, the Zero Child, the Divine Blade of Wind, and Yin out of our business. Military police affiliated with the SSS, such as Second Lieutenant Noel and Chief Sergei, were also given orders that took them to Mishalem. Isn't that right, Major Michael? Yes, including Speaker McDowell and his granddaughter. <laughs> How could you? <sighs> Why? Why would you? <laughs> Don't you get it? It's so they can't go and save the day. The special support section, the heroes of the past, are now nothing more than a nuisance to the Empire. But they can't charge them with anything and lock them up, because that would anger all the dear little citizens. So they're just going to stop them from helping making them slowly fade from people's minds until they're completely forgotten. Though, in actuality, they could wipe those nobodies out at any time if they really wanted to. <sighs> Kinda leaves a bad taste in my mouth, though. Always wanted to go around with the Divine Blade of Wind. Yuna... Are you all right? Everyone! Rain, are you okay? You're here. I take it you've cleared the building of archaisms? <laughs> All done with your little objections? If so, we'll finally be taking our leave. What? Th that's. Later, Kruger. See you around, Ashen Kid. The debaucherous prince, too! Once our experiment is successful, we'll come say hello again. I can't thank you enough for being such excellent company this fine evening. Uh, did all that really just happen?
Well, the immediate threat has passed, but I suppose it's time for our hero to get to work. <laughs> you. Why? Yuna? What are you... Why? Why are you all trying to take away our pride? You occupied us, dragged us into your war with Calvert, brought those horrible cannons into our country, and now our light, our one last hope. Give it back! Give us our crossbell back! The free city where anyone could dream! Give it back! This is truly an honor. Here, a reward. Good work out there. Okay, I brought what I promised. Then that's... A document with official orders from the Imperial government. That's what's been calling Reen and Valimar to action over the past year. How tasteless. Thank you for coming all this way so early in the morning. Are you done blockading Michelum? It's surprisingly tough, actually. Bannings and his pals were driven into the wetlands, and the military police are stuck waiting. McDowell and his granddaughter are busy dealing with a bunch of minor bigwigs, too. If we let our guard down, they'll squirm through, but I'm sure Claire can hold the fort just fine. Uh. Damn it. You're making a kind person like her do something like that? <sighs> I don't think you've got the time to be sitting here complaining. Let's just get this whole song and dance taken care of. Yes. I have no objection. Ashen Chevalier Reen Schwarzer, 
The following orders are on behalf of the Imperial Government. Uncover the goals of the Society and restore order to Crossbell. Orders accepted. We'll help too, of course. Yes. I need to watch for signs of my sister. I've got permission from the inspection team. Allow me to help too. That's a relief. Take care of him, please. Thank you. I'll gladly accept your help. That won't be a problem, will it, Major Michael? Do as you please. Although I can't allow First Lieutenant Randolph to accompany you. <laughs> well, I don't think anyone expected you to. <sighs> Randy, I'm glad I was able to hear about the support section from you. Huh? Honestly, I don't know if I can measure up. But Class 7 and I will take on your role. I'm sure you'll do a great job. <laughs> Just leave the students to me, then. When it comes to communication, I'm sure Teotot will be able to help, too. So, please, fix this mess for all of us. Understood! Sheesh. Maybe I didn't need Agamon after all. But this is fine. I've got enough on my plate as is setting up our little countermeasures against Calvert. Good luck, everyone. Have fun. Instructor, you're going, aren't you? Yeah. But this time, I'm not going to stop you guys from coming. I promised you, didn't I? That said, are you sure you're okay leaving Yuna here alone? That's... You're right. We can't do that. I'm sure she's been way past her limit this whole time. Since the field exercise location was announced, even. I could give her temporary leave to go be with her family. But, because the situation is the way it is, I want her to come to terms with things on her own. My hope is that she realizes what she should do. As a member of the branch campus, and as someone who loves Crossbell from the bottom of her heart. If possible, I'd like the three of you to catch up to me together. <laughs> I'm still a bit hesitant. But understood. Take care of her. Oh, and I'd like you to relay a message. Hmm. The new Class 7 is a good group of kids. Yeah, they seem to get lost, wander and stumble, but keep moving forward all the same. <laughs> it's those experiences that will shape who they are in the future. Just like you guys. <laughs> <laughs>